The Michigan legislature changed Michigan's Workers' Disability Compensation Act back in 2011. What were the changes and how have the changes affected those working in the state of Michigan? We're coming to you today from the Grand Rapids Public Museum in downtown Grand Rapids. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Laurel Hess and this is Comcast Newsmakers. Joining me now is the director of the Michigan Workers' Compensation Agency, Kevin Elsenheimer. Thank you so much for joining us Laurel, today. Laurel, it's a pleasure. Thank you. Before we talk about how uh, much better things are today after this uh, legislation, fill us in for those who perhaps don't understand exactly what work comp is, uh, who pays it, who gets it, what's it all about? Well, you're fortunate if you don't know what workers' compensation is. It's one of those things that you really don't want to know about unless you really need it, but you want to know it's there when you do. Workers' compensation is a system in place in Michigan and every other, uh, every other state in this country that makes sure that if you're injured on the job that you have a path to recovery, number one, that you have lost wages, number two, uh, and that you get vocational rehabilitation to get you back on the job as soon as possible. My job as director is to make sure that that happens, number one, but to do it as cost effectively as possible. So it's less expensive for who now? The employers who are paying their monthly premiums um, for this insurance to cover their employees? We hope so. In Michigan, uh, back in 2011, Governor Snyder, along with leaders in the legislature, moved on a package of bills that resulted in some pretty significant changes to Michigan's 100-year-old workers' compensation statute. Those changes did things like redefining the definition of disability, just making a few tweaks and bringing it up to date, but doing so in a way that resulted in a couple of things, making sure that we were able to get our workers back to work more quickly and also bringing about the possibility of lower long-term premiums for our employers in this state. So are we paying less today uh, as employers paying work comp premiums than we were uh, two, three, four years ago? Well, there's always room to improve, and we certainly have, uh, have a ways to go. We would like to be at the very top of the country. We're not quite there yet, but we're making good progress. We can report, though, that an independent third-party organization that does analyze rates in this state and other states around the country has said that Michigan, for three years in a row now, has been able to reduce its pure premium cost, basically a, a rate keeper or a, uh, a cost that uh, is used by insurance companies to set rates. Has it decreased that state, pardon me, decreased that cost by over 7% for three years in a row? That's a 21% decrease to the, uh, to, uh, pardon me, to the employers of this state. Well, and the governor has been, you know, uh, one of his big pushes has been to make our state more business friendly. Obviously, this falls in that realm. Anyone who's looking at uh, locating a business or loca uh, starting a plant is going to look at the workers' compensation system in that particular state. We know employers look at the workers' compensation system in Michigan and compare it to our neighbors. And the information that we have today is that our uh, rates now are much more competitive in the Midwest and, in fact, are a net benefit to people that might look to come and start businesses here in Michigan. So rates are a part of the picture and they're certainly a large part of the picture, but the whole system, uh, is it fairly uh, similar to other states and user friendly and uh, you know, for both the employer and the, the, the employee? It is, and we're working very hard to make it more user friendly. We wanna make sure that people are gonna be able to access our system online, that they're gonna be able to do it uh, using mobile information. That will be coming shortly. We're making significant investments in our technology to get there. Our employment insurance program recently made those investments and we're following their lead and, and hopefully going to be having those in place soon. So our system overall is working much more productively than it was in the past and we're seeing a, a great deal of improvement. All right, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. For more information on today's topic, you can visit michigan.gov forward slash WCA. Today's Comcast Newsmaker was Kevin Elsenheimer, the director of the Michigan Workers' Compensation Agency.